so today I'm going to be doing a look for the Chinese New Year. Now, I do not celebrate the Chinese New Year. I'm not Chinese or Asian, but um, it's coming up and I thought I might have some viewers out there who would be interested. And I've been really loving a red lip, so I thought I would go ahead and do a look for you um, using the colors of red and gold, which are the colors for the Chinese New Year. So, what I did today is a red and gold lip and I have gold eyeliner on and if you guys are interested to see how I did this look, keep on watching. Okay guys, so I'm starting with an eye primer and as you can see I'm just using my Tarte eye primer, putting that all over the top and the bottom of my lid. Next I'm just taking a flat shader brush and I'm just putting a really light shimmer on the eyelid and a little bit up into the crease. I'm just doing this so that there's a little bit of color on there, but nothing too crazy. Next I'm just going to put on my liquid eyeliner and you can see you have to be pretty careful with this because it's pretty easy to make mistakes. So. Uh, if you want to, you can just use a regular pencil or a felt tip marker. under my eye and fixing up any spots that I miss with my liquid liner. Alright, now for the sparkle part. I'm just taking a glitter eyeliner and just very carefully going right above where our black liquid eyeliner is. Now just take this, you know, slowly so that you get it on there precisely. And just take that all the way out to the end and you can just apply over and over to get the opaqueness that you want. Okay, I'm just going to go ahead and curl my lashes. We are going to use falsies but I'm just going to curl these so they'll stick a little bit better. And then I'm just going to put a thin coat of mascara on. Waterline, I'm just taking a white pencil. If you don't want something that bright, you can take a more flesh tone color for you. Alright, so just put that on the waterline. And then I'm going to take it and put it on the inner corner of my eye, like so, just to brighten it up. Let's go ahead and smudge that out just for a little bit of a brightening effect. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and put some mascara on the bottom lashes. And there's our eye look. Alright, now I'm going to go ahead and put a little bit of chapstick on and that way it'll soak in as we're doing the rest of our face. I'm just going to put my BB cream and then buff that all over my face. I'm just using a large powder brush from e.l.f. That I'm taking some NYX powder foundation and just buffing that all over. This has like a powder finish and a little bit more coverage. Now I'm taking a blush and I'm just putting it on the apples of my cheek and then pulling it back up to my temples. Now I'm just going to put on my highlighter. 
and all the places where the sun would touch my face. And that's the face. Now, to do my eyebrows, I just do them very lightly, so I'm just taking a little bit and filling them in on each side. Okay, now for the lips. First, we're gonna line with a red lip liner. Sorry about the blur, I'm getting used to this new camera. Okay, so outline the top and the bottom, and again, just take your time so you get a precise line. All right, and then we're going to fill that in. It's just gonna help the longevity of your lipstick, and that way if your lipstick kind of wears off, your liner is gonna be there to make sure it doesn't look too weird. Now we're going to put on our lipstick again. Make sure you're trying to follow the outline of your lip as much as you can. And just take your time. Okay, so top and bottom. And now to just kind of dull down the shininess and so that it doesn't come off as easy, I'm going to blot that. You can use tissue paper. I just have some toilet paper here that's fine. So just blot that and that will help it stay a little longer. So to get the gold, I don't have any gold lipstick or anything, so I'm just using some eyeshadow. So I'm just taking that and dabbing that in the center, and then pressing my lips together to kind of make it uh, dilute a little bit. And again, to make it a more opaque, just add more, and then just press your lips and kind of just dab it out so it's not quite as crazy looking. And there's the lip. Okay guys, there is our final Chinese New Year makeup look. Hope you liked it. Okay guys, I hope you have enjoyed today's makeup tutorial. If you have any questions on which product I used, um, obviously they were titled in the video, but I will have a description of everything down below, so definitely go and check that out. If you still have any questions or if you just wanna leave a comment, leave comments below. Let me know what other looks you would like me to do. Are there any holidays in your country that are coming up? that you would like me to maybe do a look for you guys. I'm always willing to try new things and celebrate new cultures, so definitely leave a comment below. Let me know what you guys think. If you've enjoyed today's video, please hit the like button. Let me know. Um, that just helps me to kind of know, you know, which videos you guys like, if you want me to keep doing makeup tutorials for you. Um, you know, it's always helpful for me. <laughs> so I will have other videos down here. Definitely go and check those out. Watch the videos. Let me know if you like them. And if you're not already subscribed, go ahead and hit the subscribe button right over there. Yep, over there. Hit it and keep coming back and commenting with me and letting me know what you guys are loving. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye everybody.